ACPA community, my name is Bernie Leong and I remain honored to be the ACPA 21 Convention Chair. I come to you today from Seattle, Washington, which is the home of the Duwamish people. As we all know, the last several months have been very challenging on so many different levels. We've had to learn new things and develop new ways of teaching and find new ways of conducting our daily tasks as higher education professionals. Now, after many weeks of information gathering, careful consideration, and thoughtful discussion, we are excited to provide ACPA 21 as a fully virtual experience, and we hope that you share that excitement with us. Our convention steering team is here today with a few thoughts on our new direction. Hi, I'm Aja Holmes, and I'm sharing today from Sacramento, California, the original lands of the Nissan, Madu, Miwok, Padwin, and Wintu tribes. As program chair, my team has been working hard to pivot and refocus our aim to provide outstanding learning opportunities during ACPA 21. We're excited to offer all of our programs in a virtual format and will work diligently to make sure your experience is what you've come to expect as an ACPA annual convention attendee. A reminder that the call for programs is currently open and we encourage you to consider submitting a proposal. Change is inevitable and we are committed to providing programming that address current issues, navigates the real questions in student affairs, and highlights the strategic imperative for racial justice and decolonization. Hi, I'm Sarah Fur, not quite like Jennifer, and I'm coming to you from Chicago, Illinois, the indigenous lands of the Council of the Three Fires, the Ojibwe, the Odawa, and the Potawatomi Nations. As previously mentioned, Pivoting to a virtual convention required making some tough decisions and honing in on what is truly important to us as an association. Our commitment to inclusion is the center of our work and will continue to guide us as we move forward in our planning. As Equity and Inclusion Chair, my team and I will be ensuring that we make ACPA 21 a truly inclusive experience. A virtual ACPA 21 allows it to be accessible to everyone, regardless of location around the globe, health concerns, or other circumstances that might prevent a fully engaged in-person experience. That gets me excited about the possibilities. Good morning, I'm Greg Grace, and I come to you from Sanford, California, the tribal home of the Moet Ohlone people. As the Indigenous Advisor to the ACPA 21 team, I continue to make sure that Indigenous voices, experiences, and histories stay centered in how we experience convention. We may be scattered around the world during convention, but it doesn't mean that we can't take time to understand the impact of our past, make amends for our present, and plan for a more indigenized future. Hi, I'm Peter Packett, and I'm coming to you from Myrtle Beach, South Carolina the original lands of the Waccamaw and PD people. ACPA is as committed as always to being there for you as you navigate your career in student affairs and higher education, and we're gonna to continue to serve you at this convention. As the Career Development and Advancement Chair, I'm working with my team to gather ways that you, our convention participant, can best use your time to connect with professional networks and learn about career opportunities through our 2021 Career Wellness Center. Hey everyone, it's Todd Snobble. I'm coming to you from Sellersville, Pennsylvania on the original tribal lands of the Lenny Lenape people. In some ways, nothing has changed. We are still so excited and we are developing every plan with the intention to provide you with a great convention experience. And on the other hand, everything has changed because this is a completely new way of working and engaging and being for all of us. Know that we are investigating how to provide the aspects of convention that we are all used to, while also expanding our ways of thinking and propelling us into the future to convention at large. We don't have all of the answers yet, but we certainly will provide the same ACPA convention experience that we are excited to have you join us for. So whether you are a convention veteran or experiencing it for the first time, we can't wait for you to be on this journey with us. Hello everyone, Vernon Wall here, your ACPA president, coming to you recorded from Washington, D.C., our nation's capital, um, the ancestral home of several um, Native and Indigenous tribes, but primarily the Piscataway. 
I'm so proud of our convention planning team. I'm also very proud of our governing board and our international office and all of you for your continued interest in the ACPA 21 experience. It's going to be great and I'm confident that we're gonna offer you something that you won't wanna miss. Trust and believe, this is Vernon Walls Convention, so it's going to be rocking. No matter where we are, we are ACPA, and this March we will gather together at convention to learn, to network, to develop, and to experience a once-in-a-lifetime event. As always, we will continue to keep you updated on our progress, including new rates, updated offerings, and, even, and more. Um, so stay tuned um, for all of those updates. Finally, the ACPA 21 experience will continue to be an experience that is refreshing, revitalizing, and real. But now it will also be reimagined.